In other news tonight, park districts across central Illinois are making major cuts to summer activities. WCI3's Courtney Bunting has that story. In just a few short weeks, this pool would have been flooded with families. Instead, they'll be closed all summer. And Champaign's Park District isn't the only one facing major changes. 50 people in a pool, um, that's, that would definitely be a big challenge. A mix of money, staffing, and safety concerns are behind Champaign Park District's decision to not open Sholem Aquatic Center. When you look at the cost to operate a facility like Sholem Aquatic Center, and then the revenue of um, the low attendance allowed, it just didn't really make fiscal sense. The pool isn't the only victim to cancellations. Taste of CU, which was heading into its 50th anniversary, also won't happen this year, as well as team sports. Decatur's Park District also had to make some difficult adjustments, including not opening their Splash Cove water park. Really tough day to day, tough decision. Uh, but it was one of those those decisions that ultimately had to be made. Park district leaders are reminding people that there are plenty of other ways to enjoy the beauty of outdoors. We also now have our pickleball courts available again. Our tennis courts are available again. There are some small things we can do like private tennis lessons. So that has been approved. We have miles of trails available for people over 700 acres of green space in Champaign. And despite the differences, there are still lots of fun things in store in the coming months. Keep in touch with us because we are here for the community. We're not going anywhere. Reporting, I'm Courtney Bunting, WCIA3, your local news leader. Everyone who purchased passes with the Champaign Park District will get refunds. Decatur Park District is also working with people on an individual basis. Decatur and Champaign Park Districts both regularly post on social media with different ways you can get involved. We have a list of cancellations for park, to park districts across central Illinois on our website, WCIA.com.